my god! Damn! This man disrespected him. He said, "Ping, ping." Thank you guys for coming in and watching episode 7 of Jujutsu Kaisen with me. By the way, if you guys are watching this video, I did upload episode 4, 5, and 6 in a little bit of like a compilation video, but for some reason, YouTube freaking suppressed the holy hell out of that video. If you want to check that video out right after this video, I would gladly appreciate it. But anyway, let's get started. Let's watch this video and let's see what's going to happen because I remember the guy with the blindfold on. I'm sorry, I don't remember his name. With the white hair, he got attacked by the guy that looks like Squidward from that one episode when Squidward was like a superhero with a Krakatawa shit, but he came down from the sky and my man broke the whole floor. I think this dude with the blindfolds about to make him catch these hands. Let's see what's gonna happen. Like I said again, if you guys enjoy, hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys are new. Let's get it started. Yeah, so right here, the taxi driver was basically talking to him. And then out of the blue, this guy was just like, yo, stop the car. Look at him, stop the car. My man felt the presence. He was like, nah, somebody out here. Somebody want these hands. Somebody want these hands. Yo, he's such a good guy that he let the taxi driver leave in one piece. My man just waiting in the middle of the fucking, what is this, a highway or some shit? But this man came down crazy. Who are you? My man about to give him the work. That's what's about to fucking happen. Ew, what the fuck is that? My man summoned a volcano on the wall? Whoa! My man, how you, what? The wall summoned the nipple and my man just said, Pfft. that was easier than I expected. Nah, man, don't underestimate this guy. This guy is super fast. He probably right behind you. He what? Did he just, what? He's a cursed spirit, but he can communicate clearly. Did he just like eat the, sh did he eat the hit or did he like, you know, get away from it? An unregistered special grade? He said unregistered like as if it's like fucking persona with a compendium. He was unregistered, bro. Oh, he about to beat his ass. And he got the Kool-Aid smile on deck. This volcano Krakatawa guy better dip because he about to catch them hands. He was avoiding other sorcerers coming back. What? He's summoning bugs? That makes no sense. I thought you were a volcano, not a bug. Not a bug, man. What is this guy? Bro! Were they like suicide bugs? A two-stage attack of sound and explosion. This man is just playing with this guy. He just burned his head? Yo! The animation in this shit is going nuts. Yo, these animators were going ham with these fighting scenes. I took a look for myself and it was just an overestimation. That human was just a, as fragile as the rest. He'd think he beat him. Bro, my man's like, yo, I'm fine. What are you talking about? Oh, he looking a little shook. To put it simply, you didn't even hit me. You didn't even hit me. I know I touched you and killed you. No, you didn't, bro. You touched the infinity that exists between you and me. Infinity? I'll show you. Wait, what? Come on, dude. Oh my God, this guy's a clown. No hostility. I guess I'll see what it's about. This man is crazy. Why would you touch him? He's going to kill you. I can't touch him. It stops just before him. This is infinity? You're not exactly stop, but the closer you get, the slower you go. Wait, so it, what is this man, like a Pokemon? My man's touching his hands and everything. Don't be shy now. You're making me embarrassed. My man is putting his fingers together. What the fuck? Damn. It's not just a blow of strength by what? My man said, yo, give me that stomach. Boom. Oh my God. Damn. This man disrespected him. He said, ping, ping. My jujutsu just brings it forward in reality. Convergence, divergence. What do you think happens when one touches this void? Curse technique reversal red? Did my man just nuke him? He hit like 20 trees, bro. 20 trees. He's running now. He's like, I gotta get the fuck out of here. The music. He grabbed his face. He said, give me that face, bro. Right behind him. Ready to give him the Tims. Oh, this is perfect. What's he about to do to him? He even told him you're going to die, but you'll die. The guy even warned him. He said, yo, if you fight him, you're going to die. And I don't even know why. So then why the hell? It wasn't just talk. Of course it wasn't just talk. If the guy told you straight up out the gate, you're going to die. No matter if I can't hit him, I'll just drag him into my domain. Where did he go? My man's gonna be right behind you. Oh, he about to take the finger. My man freaking went so quick to get Itadori. That's Sukuna's ve- Oh my god. This is Itadori. And he's here to watch? That is so fucked up. My man brought his student. 
My man brought the student. He was like, yo, so you about to see a demonstration right now. I'm about to fuck his shit up. Just stay right there, sit down in the water, get comfortable, get yourself some snacky snacks. I'm about to fuck this guy up real quick, all right? Just do what I do, just take notes, all right? That's so crazy. He was still watching movies. Is this Lord of the Rings? What are the references? They keep referencing anime movies in this damn show. Talking to him doesn't cause a problem either. You need something? Looks like we'll be able to um, increase the output quickly and move on to the next stage. Wait, that's what he did? That's when he went to go pick him up? So you're telling me my guy got fucked up and he's in the water laying there. And my man teleported over there to be like, hey, yo, so Itadori, let's go real quick. We got something. We got something to do. And they're on the water like as if they got chakra from freaking Naruto. I can't kill Itadori due to our future plan. Is he caught onto our goals? What's the brat for? He's a shield? A shield? No, no, he about to teach him a lesson. I told you, he's here to watch. I'm in the middle of teaching this boy a lot of things. That's fucked up. He said, yo, don't worry, just keep fighting me, bro. I'm just here to teach a lesson. You're weak. Gojo's disrespecting him. Gojo disrespecting him. He said, yo, you a pussy boy. You a rank one. I'm going to enjoy swallowing up this smug face. My man said Krakatawa. Itadori's like, oh shit, this guy crazy. You'll be fine. Just stay close to me. Oh shit. Oh, oh domain expansion? Gojo is just like, he's fine, hands in his pocket. Bro, the floor is breaking. He put him inside of a volcano. Coffin of the Iron Mountain. Wait, so when they were in the juvenile place, that was an incomplete domain expansion? Burning out a domain consumes a ton of energy. That's really good to know. Oh, it's like a buff. So when you use domain expansion, it's kind of like you get into like a, like a big ass area where, where your abilities get heightened. But he can't even touch go. You can go out the domain, which is usually impossible. If I neutralize the infinity of yours with a dense domain, then my techniques will reach. Yeah, they'll hit. Infinity? Oh, he doesn't even know about the infinity. I came here half in jest. The most effective way to deal with the domain is what? He's about to take off the blindfold? He's taking off the blindfold? Oh my God, what's about to happen? Whoa, his domain expansion. He's beautiful! Infinite Void? He fucked him up, he took him to space! Yo, did he just mind break him Yugi style? He mind broke him! He took him to a black hole! I can't see anything, I can see everything, I can feel everything. Damn, I meant just- <laughs> This is the inner world of limitless, perception, communication. Every action involved in living is forcibly carried out at an infinite number of times? He's why is he so cute? You can't do anything but just die peacefully. But I have questions I want to ask you. So I'm letting you off the hook with this. Yo! He mind broke him Yugi Yami Yugi style. My man said, open your mind. Who told you to come after me? That's crazy. This guy is broken. He really is the strongest Jujutsu warrior as a living organism. He's on another level and he's hot. Damn, they were watching him from a distance. I can't let people from the school see my face, so I'll be going home now. If you want to go save him, go ahead and save him. Wait, so he's actually going to go down to try to save him? The guy that speaks backwards is going to go save him? Flowers? What what a beautiful power. It's beautiful. Whoa, the tree's about to eat him. He says, sorry, I lied. I'm about to die. Oh, come on. He's good at hiding his presence because he's in the forest. He's way creepier than Volcano Head. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> they managed to escape because of me. <laughs> and he said, though, you're the one that brought me here, so it's not my fault. It's better to have a concrete goal. Yo, fuck Volcano Head. That's crazy. For the next month, you'll be watching movies and fighting me. That's great training. Will I still be alive in a month from now? After that, practical combat, you'll take on several harder missions. All right. This is great. It's great to learn how to fight this guy because he's like one of the most broken people in the show. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's the guy with the with the little bear that was punching people. Whoa, did he just go into the beach, a.k.a.? Like, he looked like he in Danganronpa right now. Where the hell did he just go? How can you say that when you see me like this? He, Yo, he almost died. This man almost got squashed. They're trying their hardest to get this guy fucked up. They're trying to gang up on him. No objections here. Let's be cunning about it, like curses should. What the fuck, is he a Frankenstein? He looks like he's like half human, half curse. There's something wrong with that guy. That's my thing, I don't know who that new guy is, but he looks like he's probably, like, I don't know, I'm just making a guess. Somebody in the comments is gonna probably be like, no, you're wrong. I feel like he's kind of like half human, half cursed spirit, kind of a little bit like Itadori, maybe he's, possessed by a i don't fucking know bro 
but right now i see that their main objective is to get rid of gojo and they want to fuck this man up they want to get him in a situation kind of like in the spider-man video game where all the villains are kind of just like surrounding him and they just fuck him up that's what they're trying to do to him right now they're trying to just kill him off because they know that he's broken maybe because i know the volcano head guy says that 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 maybe sakuna um maybe they're trying to help get all the fingers to eat Tadori so they can try to revive Sekunda and then kind of like release him so they could be the henchman. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just thinking. I'm just rambling. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys are new. I'll see you guys in the next video or in the next live stream. Peace out, my guys.